Hello and welcome back to another Marvel Champions two-handed recorded gameplay. Today we are doing the FFG challenge. Teamwork makes the dream work. Basically, it's a lot of horribly mean minions thrown into the hood. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're taking this on two-handed with a Lucas Bishop build and a Thor Odinson build. If you don't care about the builds, Use the timestamps to jump directly to the gameplay, but we're going to talk about how these are going to be playing. We're going to go with kind of a X-Men leadership build for Bishop with the idea of recurring band together. So we got Beak, X, Triage, Beast, grabbing band together, which I guess we can talk about band together. This is a resource card that, he, that generates a... A uh, wild resource for every ally that we control uh, to a maximum of three. And the idea is to have a lot of allies on the table. Um, we've got Pixie. And then the two main ones that will stay on the table are his Randall and Malcolm, which are his kind of signature allies. Got an uncanny X-Men as well as an honorary X-Men to keep that bonus when we do flip down to Alter Ego. Rapid response and make the call can grab anything but probably we're going to be looking at beast or beak based on the game states uh lucas is going to be handling the majority of the threat removal and so beak is the answer there we've got endurance x jet utopia x bunker then we got a superpower training a call for backup build support and a specialized training we're doing combat specialist for thor and then a frontline specialist for bishop and then normal doubles not not too many additional resources added in here but we could have we could have gone with more but here we are we're, we're gonna try it just with the six added resources but sometimes i do like to go a little bit higher because of his abilities and everything shuffle that a little bit later we're running an aggression deck with thor because you got to right we got angela nick x valkyrie throg and thor now here along with lady sif are Asgard allies, so we're going to have a Bifrost. We can play those from our deck, effectively reducing the effective cost by one because they're not in your hand. Into the fray for minion control as well as some management of the threat on the main. Relentless Assault, Lock and Load. It's going to grab the Rifle for Bishop, and Odin Son can either grab Mjolnir, or I'm also running a Hand Cannon in here. Probably grab the Hand Cannon. We've got two copies of boot camp. We're running a lot of allies, and so Odin is going to get one as well as Bishop. Get those boot camps. Hall of Heroes, Quinn Carrier, Unshakable, the Limitless Stamina's because we got that sweet sweet fourteen health over here. The Red Doubles and the the Real Doubles, and that is the idea behind the Odin Sun deck. Now the Hood, we are going to be playing Expert Hood. And the seven modular sets that were chosen for the challenge are the Acolytes, Exodus, Brotherhood, Blue Moon, Nasty Boys, Reavers, and Dark Riders. So a lot of these have teamwork. A lot of these just have a ton of minions. I think Thor is going to feast here uh, with uh, some card draw. And so I I, I did kind of want to run a Valkyrie Thor, but I was, you know what? I haven't, I wanted to break Bishop back out. So here we are. The hood is going to start on stage two with 32 health. And then let's do our setup. So the first thing, making connections. Choose seven modular encounter sets. Those were chosen. Those are here in front of us. Uh, choose one of those sets at random and shuffle it into the encounter deck. We're going to reroll a eight, nine, or ten. We got a two. That's going to be, oh, geez, it's Exodus. Dang it. Uh, <laughs> that uh, That's not that's not great. That's That's honestly not what we wanted if i could have chosen one that we did not want because we're fishing out exodus it's bad okay well that's fun when revealed each player must resolve the hood's foul play ability in player order foul play is discard the top two cards of the encounter deck actually i think we are going to shuffle another one so choose a set aside modular at random we got six now we've got bro acolytes Alrighty. And then discard the top two cards in the encounter deck. Deal the first card discarded this way that does not belong to the hood encounter set to you as a face down encounter card. So we're kind of hitting the ground running. We are also going to have Bishop start us out as first player as he has the majority of the side. Or yeah, well, 
all but one of the side schemes in his deck. Whew. Alrighty, so everybody has to do this. Each player must resolve the foul play ability. We got Bishop. Discard the top two. So he's going to get a master plan and nowhere is safe. And then Odin's son did not get that. He's going to get an Amelia Vault, which is going to be nice. We're going to get a lead where you can guarantee that card draw in the. I'm trying to figure out how I want to. I'll stack like this. There you go. Set those off screen. Within somewhat easy reach. Okay. What are we looking for? Bishop? Um, I mean, any any time we can start throwing uh character or like a beast out there. Probably not band together to start. Utopia would be excellent. Uh the uniform is very, very key. So if we can get a either a superpower training or just that straight up uniform in our opening hand, we're gonna be feeling real, real good. Because Bishop does not really want to use his um his allies as chump blockers for himself. Now we we may use those over here for Thor. Um, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Win reveal, choose one set aside. We're good there. We're good there. We're not told to do foul play anytime. I believe that happens. Oh no, that's a that's I see I, I haven't played the hood that much. I do like the hood. But the hood is uh the hood is kind of mean. We got six cards starting here with Bishop. We got Band Together, Stored Energy, Band Together, Command Authority. Uh, Command Authority and a Rapid Response. But we're going to mulligan four cards there. Concussive Blast, Stored Energy. Bishop's Uniform, there it is. Let's freaking go. And a Malcolm. Alrighty, we're happy with that. Odin's son gets uh five cards. Ooh, there's Asgard though. That's a that's a pretty sweet first pull. Hammer throw. Boot camp. Strength. And a relentless assault. We'll go ahead and mulligan hammer throw and the relentless assault. I'm just realizing that I put all of these minions right where I get the hero escape stuff out of here. Where my discard pile goes. We got power of aggression. Let's go. And an Angela. Ooh, my friends. Ooh, 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 my friends. Do love that. Excellent. Bishop is going to start us out. We have, after you change to this form, add a temporal card in your discard pile to your hand. That is after you change to the form. We cannot do that this first turn. I think probably what we will look at doing is... We are going to want to flip up with Odin's son. Uh, I think Angela... Is going to go fish for a minion, get that card draw. Then we're going to be able to get a boot camp um, and be able to deal with that. I think we'll probably also just flip up with Bishop as well. Especially since we have the uniform and not running justice or anything super, super heavy threat removal. We probably want to be in hero form more than not. So let's flip out the Bishop. After a bishop takes any amount of damage from an attack, discard an equal number of cards from the top of your deck. Add each resource discarded this way to your hand. We're going to go stored energy for a command authority, removing three threats from the main scheme. And then we paid for it with a resource, so we're going to get the draw into the X-Jet. Alrighty. Ooh. We're going to use stored energy and a concussive blast to play the X-Jet. We're going to generate a wild resource for... Our X-Men hero here. Use Malcolm to play Bishop's Uniform. Now, the reason that Bishop's Uniform is so very critical to this kit is after you resolve his hero ability, uh, exhaust Bishop's Uniform and heal one damage for every resource in your hand, which is just awesome. Let's punch the hood for two. Odin's son. We're going to go find Mjolnir. Where are you at? There's the helmet. There we go. Add that to our hand. Mjolnir is a restricted. It gives him plus one in the aerial trait. We're going to flip up to Thor. We're going to play Angela. When Angela enters play, we search the top 10 cards for a minion. That was six, right? 
eight, ten, and put that into play, which will trigger our have at the response. We've got a Delgado Zotus. Okay, well, it's definitely going to be Delgado, even though. Yeah, that's not great. Um, okay, we'll just grab. But Exodus is so annoying to take care of. We do have to take care of Delgado before he, uh, before our, um, villain phase because we know we're gonna be dealt, uh, Amelia, which would trigger the teamwork, and we, uh, we're gonna try and not trigger the teamwork here. We engage the minions, so we're gonna draw one, two cards. We got a Power of Aggression and a 4 Asgard is going to play a boot camp over here, giving us a third attack. I really want to play Asgard. But it, that means I'm not playing Mjolnir. And if I'm not playing Mjolnir, then I cannot take out Delgado. Ooh, that's kind of exciting. Um, ooh, okay. I feel like I have to play Mjolnir, unfortunately. Then I can just hang on and just lose a little bit of tempo, but we'll go ahead and drop a Mjolnir onto the table. It's going to give us a plus one attack. We'll go ahead and have Angela swing for three. She'll take one consequential, one retaliate damage on Delgado, and then we'll have Thor knock him out. We'll hang on to these two. And we will stand up and draw some cards. Excellent. Bishop has got a stored energy. Make the call. Endurance. Energy conversion. And a energy. Thor only gets four cards. So we got strength, Asgard, Thor's helmet, and defender of the nine realms. Defender is going to work. All right, let's add two thread here. The hood is going to attack Bishop. We will take it to the face. It's going to be one, two, three. So we will take three damage going down to nine. Then we're going to discard one, two, no, three. And heal for two. Because we have two here. Takes us back up to 11. The hood is going to attack Thor. We're going to have Angela block this one. It's going to be a plus one. Angela leaves play. Deal out in counter cards. Bishop has got a master plan. We're going to discard cards until we get a side scheme. Oh, there we go. The Acolytes. Each Acolyte minion gains guard comes in with six threat. And a extra encounter card every phase. We do like that. And we got uh, Acolyte Frenzy. Each Acolyte minion engaged with you activates against you. If you're not engaged with an Acolyte minion, this card gains Surge into the Hood's Pistol. Gives him a plus one, plus one. Thor is going to get a Amelia Vault, which is going to trigger his response to draw one, two cards. We do have a Lady Sif. And we got a Sinyaka. There we go. We're going to get our first teamwork activation. So uh, we'll take three damage. Off of the attack. But we only get to trigger this one time, unfortunately. This is going to pass over here. And. We are going to have Thor swing for three here. We're gonna we're we're risking it a little bit. Um, we're gonna use a nope, not the defender of the nine rounds. We want that one. Uh, Thor's helmet, limitless stamina, and a strength. Uh, to play a Lady Sif. After Lady Sif enters play, ready Thor or Odin. So we'll go ahead and ready there. We've got a Thor and a. Actually, before yeah, no, we're gonna go ahead and do this. Lady Sif and a Thor will take out both of these. Lady Sif will take out Sinyaka. Thor will take out Amelia. Player defeated Amelia is confused. And then Sinyaka. Player who defeated Sinyaka is stunned. Uh, you know what? Actually, 
we are going to leave Amelia out. She has three damage on her. Because I don't want to be confused. Because I want to play Defender of the Nine Realms. We may take a hit here. But we're going to Defender of the Nine Realms. Discard cards from the top of the encounter deck until you discard a minion. Put that minion into play with you. Remove three threat from a scheme. This is where we want to hit Exodus, I think, right? Because his is a win reveal, not put into play. Oh my goodness, yes. Win revealed does not trigger because it is put into play. We hit Exodus, Retaliate 1, and Villainous. Nasty stuff. And then we'll remove 3 threat here. Take this down to 3. Then we will draw two cards, Relentless Assault and a Valkyrie. Why did I think I had enough resources to pay for Asgard? What, what was I thinking? I do not know. I honestly do not know. Oh, and oh, I am stunned. Oh, that was a that was bad. That was just a bad. Do we have have we passed build support? We haven't. I may just try and go build support into this thing. Into the Asgard. Um, I did. Yeah, I. I misplayed that one. Alrighty. Um, cool. We'll go ahead and attack to remove the stun. And we'll go Relentless Assault to hit. Uh, Amelia. And we're going to hope to grab Asgard later. No, I am confused. That was uh that was not not the smartest. Not the smartest. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh over here for Bishop. Let's see what we got in our we got Malcolm in our discard pile for a make the call. Do we have anything good over here for Thor? We have a Valkyrie. Angela. I feel like a Valkyrie is a decent decent grab. Let's go ahead and go make the call energy the X Jet to grab a Valkyrie. After Valkyrie enters play, deal two damage to a minion, three damage if you paid for this card using a lightning resource i don't think that that triggers that's actually a really interesting question let me know if you use make the call to grab a valkyrie does her response trigger but i don't think so because you paid for make the call not for valkyrie regardless we're gonna go two damage there we're gonna go uh stored energy for an endurance to give us three more health pop us up to 14 and then we've got a bishop and a valkyrie thwarting down the acolytes. Don't want those extra encounter guards. I'd rather have the attack here. Who attacked? Oh, no, I valkyrie. Wow, I am. Okay, here we go. This is why I do not play these games live. <laughs> All right, we'll stand up. Thor has got a Professor X, a Power of Aggression, Nick Fury, and a Hand Cannon. Bishop, we've got Energy Conversion. We're going to hang on to that. Um, strength, Call for Backup, Beak, and a Rapid Response. We're going to go up to four here on the main. The Hood is going to look at Thor. And attack for two. We're going to block. We're not going to block. We're just going to take it. It'll be two plus three, of course. Down to six. And we've got Exodus attacking for one. We'll take it. Plus two, down to three. That uh, That's a lot of health real quick. That's fine, though. We're probably flipping down. Okay. And we've got... Bishop. Uh, the hood is going to attack. We are going to play Energy Conversion. When an enemy attacks, shuffle each resource card in your discard pile into your deck. You cannot take more than three damage for this attack. We got one, two. Let's throw all of these back in there. Let's go. Three, four, five, six. 
Woo! So fun. So these get shuffled in. He's going to attack for two, three. Perfect. One, two, three. We'll take these two. X bunker gets discarded. And then we're going to trigger uniform. So we take three damage. We're going to heal three damage, effectively getting us nothing. Sweet. Pass out in counter cards. Thor gets upper hand. The hood attacks you. Resolve the foul play ability. We're going to go ahead and block with Valkyrie. So the hood's going to attack for two plus zero. Valkyrie comes over here. And then we're going to resolve the foul play ability. Discard, discard, which <laughs> Sinister Strike gets dealt to us. So the hood is going to attack us again. Oof. Um... Huh. Um. <laughs> um. Should not have looked at that, but that's fine. Um. I think we're gonna block with Bishop. I'm gonna defend with Bishop for one. He's attacking for five, so four comes in. And we go one, two, three, four, and we're going to take stored energy. Lockjaw is really, really good for Bishop. Okay, this is going to pass over here. Bishop is going to use X-Jet to toss out a call for backup. That's going to come with six. Strength will play a beak. We'll go ahead and remove one there. We got a stored energy to play a rapid response. We had Professor X who is going to thwart here for three. So we're probably going to have Lady Sif hit the call for backup. And so we can have Beak go ahead and thwart one here. We don't have the rifle in our discard pile quite yet, or else we may would have flipped down to grab it. So I think we're just going to stay up. We're also fairly healthy with Bishop, so we'll be okay. Um, Thor, on the other hand, probably needs to flip down. <laughs> um, okay, so we've got Lady Sif thwarting Call back up for two. I'm going to go Nick Hand Cannon, Power of Aggression to play Professor X, which will confuse the hood. And then X will remove the last off of Call for Backup. So we each get an ally. trying to think is it just a nick no it's uh it could be nick but thor's probably flipping down and trying to heal um to capitalize on the confuse so it may not be a nick but it could be a valkyrie i think it may be a valkyrie we're gonna go valkyrie and deal two damage here and then valkyrie will go ahead and swing and take out exodus Then over here, Malcolm potentially. No, let's go ahead and grab Randall. Randall's our thwarter, and I do think we're going to need some help with thwarting. Yeah, so let's go ahead and hit Randall here. So we can discard a resource card from your hand or ready Randall. If that card has a printed lightning resource, we can heal one damage from him. Okay. 
Randall will go ahead and thwart two here. Take this down to one. And we're actually just not going to trigger Randall's ability right now. So we're going to stand up. We may rapid response. Oh, wait, actually Thor's flipping down on his. Oh, Randall can't thwart because it's. Wow. Team, come on, Nelson. All right, so we're going to do that. I'm going to flip down to Alter Ego and heal with Thor to go up to seven. And we will stand up. We're going to hang on to the two resource guards. We got supercharged. There it is. Specialized training. That'll be kind of interesting. And a beast. Excellent. Odin's son gets five. We're going to get a Bifrost into the fray, lock and load, hammer throw, and a energy. We're going to add two, take this up to five out of ten. And the hood is going to attack. We're going to block with Professor X. It's going to be two, uh, three total. We're about to deck out, so I may wait to get rid of these. Um, which Bishop is going to be just a monster getting rid of these with the band togethers once we get those out because they're going to be generating all the, all of the uh, wild resources. Uh, so we might as well wait until we deck out to get rid of them so that we don't hit them again. That being said, they're actually a not... They're a really good encounter card to get because they're so easy to remove. It's kind of interesting. I may actually want to hit those. Confused against Odin Sun. Let's deal out some cards. First one, under fire, surge, reveal the top. Well, that kind of made that uh, decision for us. They are not going to be getting into the, the reshuffle. <laughs> While I'm shuffling, we got drawing near. After your turn begins, put the top card of your deck, or discard the top card of your deck. Uh, get Put one pursuit counter. Okay. Now it's bishop's time to go down. And we've got Sinister Strike, so the hood is going to attack us, which is totally fine. Oh, I never put a Pursuit Counter for the last one. I don't know what I'm doing, team. So we should be at two Pursuit Counters. We resolve two Sinister Strikes, and the hood is going to attack us. Um, We're going to take it. It's going to be three total. Uh, After this activation, put a Pursuit Counter. So we took three. We're going to discard one. Two, three, we're going to take both of those. And we've got a one, two, three, four, which we will use the uniform to heal up to 14. Okay. And then we've got a upper hand. The hood uh, attacks you. Resolve the hood's foul play ability. So the hood's attacking us again. Um, we're just going to take this one as well. So it's going to be three, four, five. Take us down to nine. Easy peasy. Odin Sun is unisone. Not when you want to engage a minion when you're an alter ego. Sad. Teamwork and toughness. When defeated, give the villain a tough status card. Okay. Over to Odin Sun. We will flip up to Thor. We do have a Throg. Ooh, that's that's a pretty decent play. Yeah, we have a we have a couple of routes here. We could drop the Bifrost and hit a hammer throw. Um Bifrost into a throg into a lock and load. But we have specialized training over here, so we probably just want to hit the specialized training. Um can hit an into the fray by frost and not trigger it i don't even actually know if we need to trigger it let's go energy hammer throw into no oh, i'm sorry let's go lock and load into the by frost we're gonna have valkyrie go ahead and knock the tough here 
We're going to swing for three against Unisome. Then we're going to energy and hammer throw for an into the fray. Deal six damage and remove five threat from the main because we did five excess damage. Okay. We're going to hang on to Lady Sif. We're not about to de uh, deck out, so we might as well just hang on to Lady Sif um, so that she can be a blocker. And we'll pass over to Bishop. We're going to discard a triage to add one pursuit counter. We are now one away. We have to discard a uh identity specific card which is kind of fun because we can just grab it using bishop's ability let's go x jet to go a specialized training that's going to come in with 10. okay let's go ahead and use a stored energy stored energy to play beast boom after beast enters play search your deck and discard pile Um, for a resource card. It's going to be a stored energy. Yeah. No, it will be a band together. Let's go ahead and grab. Do we have a band together in here? We do not. So let's go ahead and grab band together. We're going to thwart for one, take this down to nine. That's going to knock Beak out, but we're going to trigger Rapid Response to pull Beak back in. And after you play Beak from your hand, no, we're not going to do that. Just kidding. <laughs> uh, Beak's done. <laughs> for some reason, I thought he was interplay, but I'm pretty sure that's triage. So let's see, what, let's see what else we can do. We can have Beast go ahead and thwart for two. Take this down to seven. Randall can thwart for two, take it down to five. Bishop thwarts for two, take it down to three. So close. <laughs> um, we'll drop a supercharged. Ooh, actually, you know what? No, we're going to... We're going to have grab Distorted Energy instead of a band together because it does say printed icon. So we're going to grab a Stored Energy because band together doesn't have any printed resources. Okay. So we will now discard a Stored Energy to ready Randall, heal one from him. And then we're going to thwart for two more to clear this down to one. We'll feel real good next turn. We're going to dump four counters into supercharged. And then we're going to flip down, grab a uh, stored energy, then discard stored energy to discard a drawing there. Excellent. Hilarious. All right, let's stand up. Thor has got a unshakable Throg lightning strike. Quinn Carrier, and that's all we got over there. Bishop has got a Supercharged, Professor X, Band Together, Build Support. Ooh, I do like that combo. Professor X into a Build Support. You can really get some nice uh, thwarting there. Another Band Together. So that's two, four, five. Make the call. Sweet. I'm going to go three here on the main. The hood is going to attack uh, Thor. We're going to go ahead and block with Lady Sif. So it's going to be three, four, five by Lady Sif. Then the hood is going to scheme for four, seven. Excellent. Excellent. That's, yes, perfect. I probably should have. I don't know if I could have. Alrighty, cool. Choose one set aside modular set at random. Shuffle it into the counter deck. Place one acceleration token on the main scheme. So that's kind of exciting. Alrighty, let's uh let's hurry this up. We're gonna reroll a six. We got one, just the top one is the Brotherhood. Uh oh. Alrighty. 
Then we've got when revealed, each player must resolve the Hood's Foul Play ability in player order. For each player who is not dealt at least one face on encounter card, place two threat here. This is going to come in with four. Thor has got a the Hood and standard three. Oh, he's going to scheme. No, he's not. We're going to just get Loki. We're going to get Loki. No. No. All right. Uh, Bishop has got Surge, Exhaustion. Now we're gonna deal out encounter cards. Dude, the hood, the hood can, the hood can hurt. We got a dark designs place for suit counter. Pull in Loki. Loki. Uh, when I'm pretty sure this was eroded to a force interrupt. It had to have been right. <laughs> like it's not just an optional interrupt. Uh, so Loki. That's gonna draw us two cards. We got lightning strike and a god of thunder. Then Family Feud. When revealed, place one additional threat here for each Asgard card in play. We got one, two, three, four. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. That comes in with seven. That's good. It's just an acceleration icon. We may just leave it. Um, though accelerations are getting a little scary. And then these are going to be shuffled in. Next card is a Blob. Guard, after Blob attacks and damages a character, stun that character. Uh-oh. Okay. Bishop is going to Surge and Exhaust. Surges into Psionic Shield, attached to a minion. When the attached minion would leave play, instead heal all damage from that minion and put it back into play. Discard this attachment. Blob, I guess. I hate it. And then we got a upper hand. Uh, the hood schemes. And then resolve the hood foul play. So he's going to scheme for four. Another three boosts. Jeez. So seven total. That takes us up to 11. And then foul play. Acolyte frenzy. Uh, each Acolyte minion engaged with you activates. If you're not engaged with an Acolyte, it surges into a Herald of Avalon. Player defeats this game, searches the encounter deck, and discard pile for the for Exodus and reveals him. Comes in with six. Alrighty, this got bad very, 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 very quickly. It's kind of exciting. Pass this over here. And yeah. Cool. Um fun. Fun, fun, fun. Okay. We do have a lightning strike. Um So there's just not enough lightning. We could No, we're going to play God of Thunder, I guess. Um Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So supercharged, we can get we can take out Blob fairly easily. Trying to figure out what I can make the call. Lady Sif. No, because we won't. It does the timing doesn't really line up. We go Nick. We could make the call Nick. I think that's actually the play here. That feels that feels pretty decent. Because then if we can get you no Utopia's in our discard pile. Um, okay. We're going to flip up the bishop, X-Jet, and a band together. We'll play a Professor X. We'll confuse the hood. Beast will go ahead and thwart down specialized training. So we're going to get a frontline specialist here to get four health. That's going to take us up to 13. And then a combat specialist here, uh, giving us another attack boost. Okay, nice. That can be a, a one-hit kill on this Loki with Thor if we can get lucky enough. Um,
है I don't think that I am. I'm definitely playing Nick. I, yeah, no. I don't know if I'm going to hit a build support, though. I think we will probably overplay Beast, potentially. So let's go ahead and thwart three. Uh, the main is an issue. So that's fun. Um... We're gonna thwart the main. So we're at we're at eleven, we're gonna go down to eight. We could have also readied bishop. I think I wanna confuse there though. Um we're gonna go band together and a build support to make the call Nick Fury. We're gonna discard Beast from play when we do that. And then I am going to draw three cards there's a rifle i'm gonna deal an encounter card because we just decked out all righty Uh, Pixie and Supercharge will play a Rifle. Then Rifle is going to throw a damage at Blob. Because we have a band together. Randall will go ahead and thwart for two. Nick will thwart for two. We're going to take this down to four. Feel a little bit safer there. And we have two blocks, which is nice. Uh, we may actually just want to hit the frontline specialist with Bishop, though. I think we'll probably just use one of those blocks. We'll be okay. We're going to pass it over to Thor. Thor, we are going to start out just by attacking Loki. When Loki wouldn't be defeated, discard the top card of the encounter deck. If it's a treachery, it is a treachery. Uh, heal all damage. So he's back. So that's good. Um... We're going to combat specialist to draw into a Hall of Heroes. That's nice. Lightning Strike. And, well... Let's go Quinn Carrier and Lightning Strike to play a God of Thunder. Valkyrie is going to hit Loki for three. It's going to knock Valk out. I don't think I have. I'm going to go ahead and Bifrost. I do have Thor. Sweet. Okay. So we're going to play Thor from our... We're not going to get the trigger because it's after you play her from your hand. We're going to spend the four there for Thor. And then... Actually, we're going to hang on to Hall of Heroes. I'm going to use God of Thunder instead. I'm going to have Thor uh, hit Loki. It is an obligation, so Loki is gone. Sweet. That's big. I don't know why I didn't just play Throg. I think that was a that was a that was a misplay. Cool. Alrighty, let's stand up. We're gonna hang on to Hall of Heroes.
Got Thor for two. Four total cards. So Thor has Hall of Heroes, Genius, Into the Fray, and a Limitless Stamina. Bishop is going to hang on to the band together. Energy. Honorary X-Men. Concussive Blast. Make the call. Two, four, five. Excellent. We are going to add five threat to the main. Ooh. Up to nine. That threat accelerates fast. Holy cow. Hood's going to attack us for three. We're going to take it to the face. Four total damage. Uh, so we're going to hop down to nine. We're going to discard one, two, three, four. Look at that. Hit three of them. So we have one, two, three, four, five. So we'll heal for five, taking us up to 14 with the uniform. Excellent. That was pretty hype. Oh, we can block Professor X and Nick can block Blob. Okay. We're going to block bl uh, the Hood's attack against Thor with X. So it's going to be a total of three plus three. There goes X. And then we've got Blob attacking, which we will block with Nick. And I took a minion out. I think the Hood should have a top. I totally missed that. Nick goes over here. Gonna pass out in counter cards. Bishop has got Unbridled Ambition. When the villain phase begins, each player must resolve the Hood's foul play ability in order. That comes in with six. Oh. Exodus, when revealed, search and counter deck and discard power for the psionic shield attachment. Uh oh. Oh no! We're gonna go. Okay. There's two of them. I'm like 90% sure. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. Excellent. Okay. Thor has got a dark design. We're going to place a pursuit counter and then let him scheme, but he's confused. Okay. Pass this over to Thor. Um, we're going to go ahead and rifle for five on Blob to get rid of that. Okay. Um, I'm going to go Genius to play Hall of Heroes. So after you defeat a minion, you can place a glory counter. Then in Ulster Ego, you can exhaust Hall of Heroes to get some cards, which is pretty cool. Uh, we're going to go ahead and hit for three with Thor. Then we'll hit for four on Blob. Take him out. That's going to give us a counter on Hall of Heroes. And it's going to draw us a card from Combat Specialist into another God of Thunder. Do we build? I think, yeah, I think we, I think we go and we drop a God of Thunder. So now we have two of these guys. That's going to help us immensely going forward. Oh, frontline specialist. Got X bunker. Sweet. All righty. Um, cool. Cool. How's everyone doing? Um, it's Bishop's turn. Oh, and I never did this. Holy cow, team. Okay, uh, we got a Frost Giant over here, too. This is why I need to be diligent and put my icons out. Because I don't. I will not remember. I just won't. This has to go. The Unbridled Ambition is our main priority right now. We're adding five to that every single round. Holy cow. All right, we have to do some damage. We are, we are, we are not winning this race. Um, cool. Honorary X-Men. We'll go there. We're going to go Energy and a X-Jet to play Make the Call to pull in a Professor X. We'll confuse the hood. We cannot let him scheme. Um, okay. X will thwart three here, taking this down to three.
Hmm. Um. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, let's go ahead and thwart this down to one. We're going to use a band together and X bunker, I guess. No, band together and a stored energy to play concussive blast. So we're going to hit deal six damage here, which will clear the psionic shield. And we get to ready bishop. And then we're going to attack with a supercharged to take out Zotus. So I've got this frost giant hanging around. Um... Band together, we'll play a X bunker. Which we have two. I, I don't think I'm flipping down. Actually, I'm going to use a stored energy to play the band together. Um, or to play the X bunker instead of band together. Because I may use band together to get rid of this. Randall's going to thwart Unbridled Ambition. That's going to knock him out. He is confused. I think the Hood's Pistols are not the worst thing in the world right now. Um, and Band Together is just going to be another... Actually, you know what? I'm going to have left Exodus here. Because of Herald of Avalon. Um, and I mean, supercharged is still here for four, unless I attack somewhere else. But I think instead, I'm going to just Four two here. Down to four. Alrighty. Whew, it's gonna be it's gonna be something. It's gonna be something. Alrighty, let's stand up. We're gonna hang on to the band together. Thor is going to deck out here. No, he's not, because Thor only has four cards. Hammer throw, Defender of the Nine Realms, Defender of the Nine Realms, and an Into the Fray. And then Bishop has got a Command Authority. That's going to be nice. A Triage potentially is nice. Concussive Blast is great here. And a Malcolm. Sweet. And add five. Up to 14 out of 16. Cool. Cool. I think we're in a lot of trouble. I think we're in a lot of trouble. The Hood is going to attack Thor. We're going to block with X. So it's going to be Three, four, attach this card to a minion to give it a tough status card. We'll attach it to Frost Giant. It's nine health now, so that's cool. Um, nice. That kills X. The hood is going to attack uh, Bishop. We're going to take it. It's going to be three, four, one, two, three. Four. Then we're going to take one, two. After this activation ends, resolve the hood's foul play ability. Let's go down to nine. We're going to get a miss a utopia. We got a genius. And then foul play. The hood is going to get Sinyaka and the Acolytes. So Sinyaka is going to be dealt to us. We got an attack of three. We got one, two, three. Now we will trigger our uniform. We've got where you're going to heal for one, two, three, four. Takes us back up to ten. And it is encounter card time. Oh, frontline specialist is going to draw us into hey, a sword energy. I remember myself even saying, you should definitely do Frontline Specialist first. Here we are. <laughs> nice. Um, 
Let's deal out encounter cards. We got one. 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 Uh, fear of the future. You may flip to alter ego form. We can exhaust Lucas. Discard the top, this card in each resource card from your hand. Nah. We're going to flip. We will exhaust or remove this from the game. When we flip down, we are going to trigger the response to remove a temporal card. Um, it's going to be Randall. Yeah, we'll take Randall. Then we've got the Brotherhood. It comes in. Each Brotherhood mutant minions gain quick strike. And then this is going to come in with seven. We are making what we would call zero headway. Um, we got a Sinyaka quick strike and the Hood's Mantle. The Hood gains retaliate one and steady. Uh, spend one of each resource to discard this card. Sweet. Pass this over here. I don't know, my friends. Let's go X Bunker. We're going to look at the top two cards. Energy Conversion or a Make the Call. We're going to take a Make the Call. Um, and shuffle this. Getting a Make the Call is really nice. Um, we have no allies on the table. That's not great. Um, so our band togethers are a little sad. That's fine. Um, okay. We will flip up what is thor looking at we're gonna call on an no he is confused that's fine we're gonna call on an action to play defender to clear confuse then we're gonna play defender of the nine realms to discard cards until we get a minion we got a frost giant Comes in with tough, and then we get to draw two cards. Got a boot camp. And we're going to remove three threats from Herald of Avalon. Then we've also got Asgard. Okay. Okay. So that's down to one. Okay, we're good. We're good. Um, we're gonna go Bishop's Rifle. Yeah. I wanna I wanna We have a rifle for one two three four five we have a rifle for five i guess we could rifle later we don't have to rifle well i do want to rifle when we have the most cards in our hand possible um okay this is what we're going to do we're going to go stored energy to play a triage kill two damage from bishop triage is going to go ahead and clear out herald of avalon we're going to rifle for four right one two three four on exodus Okay. Let's use a strength for a command authority. Remove three threat from a scheme. Um, I'm going to go down to four here. We paid for it with a card, so we get to draw into energy conversion. Looking for allies to pull in x could be i think x is a 
decent ally. It's mainly, we just have so much threat that we have to deal with. Um, so let's use a genius and a energy conversion to play make the call for Professor X. Actually, we're going to hang on to energy conversion and use X jet here. And we're going to pull in X. Um, I'm trying to figure out if I want to or what I want to do with X. I could ready bishop. No, ready bishop isn't that great. Um. full confuse hood got professor x thwarting for three here take this down to 11 band together and a energy conversion play Randall. Oh, we do have a rapid response. I need to hit a rapid response at some point. Randall thwarts for two off the Brotherhood. We're going to... Band together for a concussive blast. I think these tufts are annoying. <laughs> um, okay, we'll just take out Sinyaka, I guess. We did pay for it with a resource so we get to ready. We're going to go ahead and thwart and remove the Brotherhood from the game. We got Malcolm in our hand. Okay. Pass over to Thor. I think we will be flipping down so we can trigger a Hall of Heroes next turn. Um, or potentially even this turn to hit an Asgard. So let's go ahead and have Thor... Ugh, dude, I hate, I hate these tough status cards. Um, we're we're not going to take out Sinyaka with that. We're gonna throw the. To knock the tough here with the it's, it's such a bad value but the concussive blast is going to knock tough off for frost giant mainly because i i want to hit i want to get two more counters on hall of heroes um thor is going to just swing and take out sinyaka to get a hall of heroes combat specialist gets a hand cannon then thor god of thunder god of thunder hand cannon We'll play a Into the Fray. Deal six damage. Uh, we did four excess. So that's going to take us from 11 down to seven. Get us another counter here on Hall of Heroes. We're going to go Bifrost, Boot Camp, and Hammer Throw to play Throg. After Throg enters play, we are engaged with the minion, so we're going to give a tough status card to him. Th 
Throg will knock tough. Thor will deal three damage to the Frost Giant. Knocking herself out. Flip down to Odin's son. Trigger Hall of Heroes to draw three cards. Lightning Strike, Limitless Stamina, Relentless Assault. We're going to use all three of these to play Asgard. Okay. Okay. All righty, my friends. Let's stand up. Thor has a hand size of six. Now defenders, limitless stamina, helmet, strength, hammer throw, and a limitless stamina. Excellent. Bishop has a Malcolm. We're going to toss Malcolm. We got one, two, three, and counter card. Bishop has a hand size of five. We are we hood goes quick. Whole hood hood puts pressure. A lot a lot of pressure. It's kind of exciting. Uh strength, energy, energy conversion, rapid response, and a beak. We're gonna add five. Hood is going to attack Bishop. Um, let's go ahead and Block with X. It's going to be four, five, six. Uh, Frost Giant is going to hit us for three. So we'll go down to nine. One. Oh my gosh. I want that Utopia so badly. We get band together in our hand. And we will uniform for three. The hood is going to scheme, but he is confused. Then Frost Giant will add one. Up to 13. Pass out cards. Bishop. He's got Avalanche. And he's got Zeal for the cause. When resolve the wind defeated of each Acolyte minion in play. Which, what was... I keep, what was Sinyaka's? Stunned. Uh, we're going to discard cards until we get an Acolyte minion. No Acolyte minion, but we get another acceleration token. We have not, we've done two damage to the hood. We've done two damage to the hood and we have four accelerations on the main scheme. Um, all of our damage is going into these minions. I'm a little, I'm a little scared. I'm a little, little tiny, tiny bit scared here. All righty. Um, cool. Thor has got Homo Superior. Oh. Um, I don't know, man. Um, over here, I guess. So fourteen minion or fourteen health frost giant. I think we're just going to try and ignore that Frost Giant now. And we've got a Trickster. Discard the top three cards of your deck. Place one thread on the main scheme for each different card type. Discard it this way. Uh-oh. One, two, two allies and a resource. So that's going to be two. That's going to take us to 15. And there goes Angela and Lady Sith. That's very sad. All righty. Pass this over to Odin, son. Flip up to Thor. Defender of the Nine Realms. Discard until we get a minion. Uh, that was... No, we're fine. Uh, so, teamwork toughness. The villain gives the villain a tough status card. We get to draw two cards. Unshakable and a Professor X. Okay.
Thor is going to take out the Frost Giant here. Give me a Hall of Heroes counter. Combat Specialist triggers to draw into a Hammer Throw. Okay. We'll go Rifle to clear the stun. Frontline Specialist needed to trigger. We got to make the call over there. Okay. Let's go Throg to knock the tough here. God of Thunder, Limitless Stamina to ready. Then we're going to knock out Unison. Villain gets a tough status card. We're going to heal two damage from the villain because that's all the damage we've done. Another counter on Hall of Heroes. We're going to go Strength and Limitless Stamina. Uh, to play Hammer Throw. We're going to deal 3 damage here. Overkill. Mjolnir pops back to our hand. Another counter on Hall of Heroes. God of Thunder will play Mjolnir. Then we've got these 3 to drop Professor X. Uh, which will confuse the hood. And then X will take 3 here. Nasty, nasty stuff, my friends. Okay. Bishop. Yeah, I think we're just going to hang on to that. That frost giant for a while. Okay. Uh, Let's use strength to play beak. After you play beak from your hand, remove three threat. So we're going to take this down to nine. Uh, we got a band together to get rid of the hood's mantle. Let's go ahead and have triage thwart one here down to eight. It's going to make triage leave play. Then we are going to, we have Nick, right? Please tell me we have Nick. We don't have Nick. No, that's sad. Uh oh. Um. Okay. Maybe we're not gonna do that. We will probably flip down. Um. So let's go ahead and attack with a supercharge, to for ten. Bishop will flip down. We're going to return a. There isn't. There isn't a temporal card. Man, we are just not hitting these at the right time. We got band together and a sword energy. I don't think I want either of these. I'll take the sword energy. Randall will go ahead and thwart two here. With stored energy to ready Randall. Have Randall thwart again for two down to four. Beak. Um, what are we going to do here? Uh, Beak will, I guess, knock the tough here. We probably do want to deal with that fresh rain at some point. So Beak might as well knock the tough. Um, let's go X-Jet. 
probably triage. Yeah. So X jet and energy conversion make the call for triage. We'll heal two here. Okay. We have a genius and a rapid response. I think I want to hang on to the genius for toss the rapid response. Triage is just going to go ahead and port one here. And we will stand up. Okay. Okay. Thor gets five. Quinn Carrier. Energy into the fray. Into the fray. And a lightning strike. Excellent. Bishop is going to hang on to the genius. Uncanny X-Men. There it is. Band together. Pixie. Beast. One more. Superpower training. Okay. We're going to add six. So we're going to go up to nine. The hood is going to attack. Thor will block with Professor X. It's enough to take X out. Hood is going to scheme. Then we're going to add one from the Frost Giant. Okay. Pass out encounter cards. Senyaka gains piercing. We're going to be stunned. But we do get to draw Relentless Assault and a Defender of the Nine Realms. Now we're cooking. Awesome. Bishop has got an evil alliance. Excellent. Add three there. Okay. This is going to pass over to Bishop. Do we have a... We do have a band together. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and band together to play Uncanny X-Men. So we all have plus one health. And then they ca it costs one less to play our X-Men too. Which is pretty sweet. Let's go X Bunker to search for command authority or a energy. I'm going to take the command authority. We're not. We're going to hang on to that first. We're going to flip up Bishop's rifle um, for two. We're going to hit two here on Sinyaka. Um, then we're going to band together for Uncanny X-Men. Be good there. But that's going to allow us to just do some stupid amounts of damage with Into the Fray. Um, so that's fun. Okay. Let's go Genius. To play Command Authority. To remove three threat here. Take this down to seven. We do get to draw a card into a band together. Ooh, that's a that's a nice little little thing there. That's fun. Um, cool. I want Utopia. I want Utopia. Um, let's go ahead and punch for two. Beak will go ahead and hit for one. Down to 19. Band together will play Beast, which will grab a band together. No, band... band uh, you know what? Beak is not going to hit for one. We're just going to use Band Together for a three resource to play Beast over Beak. And I think that's going to be a little bit better. Um, X Jet will drop a superpower training. I don't think that we have 
much for superpower training. We have like the supercharged. I don't think Thor has anything. Um, and so we're just going to start pushing some damage. Because I think we're going to lose the race if we don't. Uh, we'll band together to get rid of one of these hood pistols. Um, we have a pixie. I'm going to hang on to the pixie, actually. Okay. We got uh, Randall. Randall, I guess, will fort two here. Triage will take this down to four. Okay. And we'll pass over to Thor. Thor is going to have some fun. Let's go. We could into the fray, Sinyaka. We could relentless assault, Sinyaka. I think I'm going to into the fray, Sinyaka. So, God of Thunder, energy into the fray. So, we're going to deal six damage here. We are going to get stunned. Um, and we're going to remove five threat from the main. It's going to get us another Hall of Heroes counter. Sinyaka is gone. Let's go ahead and Defender of the Nine Realms. We're going to discard until we get a minion. There goes Toad. Draw into a Valkyrie and a four Asgard. And remove three threats from Family Feud. Down to one. Um, Gonna go ahead and attack to remove the stun. For Asgard and into the fray. It's gonna play a relentless assault to deal three overkill two. It's another Hall of Hero counter. Uh up to five. Okay. Uh, God of Thunder, Lightning Strike, Quinn Carry will play a Valkyrie. We'll throw two damage here. Actually, three damage, right? Yeah, three damage. Onto the Frost Giant. Throg will take out Family Feud. And himself. Then Valkyrie is going to throw three damage at the Hood. Down to 13. Okay. Perfect. Very happy with where we're at. Well, with the progress that we have made. How about that? I don't know if I'm happy with where we're at, but I'm happy with the progress that has been made. <laughs> All right, let's stand everybody up. Uh, we got Bishop for Concussive Blast. Make the call. Malcolm. Sword Energy. And a Command Authority. Thor has got one, two, three, four. We do deck out. Ah. So five guards. Defender. Nick. Lock and load. Power. But fully ready Bifrost is what we're talking about now. Let's go. This was Pixie. I had a hand. Alrighty. We are now going to add five. The hood is going to attack Bishop for two plus a boost card. Um, we're going to take it. Yeah. Two. It's always three, so that's five. At one, two, three, four, five. We got two there. Nice. 
We got three more from Frost Giants. We got one. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have three sword energies, three. Yeah, so we're not going to hit a resource. So we're not going to. We're going to go ahead and use Bishop's Uniform here to heal for three. And Frost Giant, we're going to block with Triage. Okay. The Hood is going to attack Thor. We're going to block with Randall. It's going to be two, three. Of course, it's only a one boost. Thin. Okay. And counter cards. Bishop has got Acolyte Frenzy. Each Acolyte minion engaged with you activates against you. Uh, this card gains Surge. Into Exhaustion. Surge. Into Blob. We got the Acolytes. Each Acolyte minion gains Guard. And Unbridled Ambition. That's got to go. Alrighty. This comes over here. Start us out with a Defender of the Nine Realms. Yeah. We got Pyro. Okay. Uh, we're going to remove three from here, taking this down to three. Uh, we'll draw two cards, Power of Aggression and Limitless Stamina. Uh, Thor will go ahead and just punch and take Pyro out. Drawn into the fray. Okay, I do like the into the fray pull there. Because we can go Power of Aggression, God of Thunder, into the fray blob, take him out. Excellent. We have a make the call. We do... And we do have an empty deck, so we can grab Professor X to confuse the hood. Professor X can take out Unbridled Ambition. So we're looking pretty decent there. Let's go ahead and have Valkyrie punch for three. Genius, Lock and Load, God of Thunder will play a Nick Fury. Should draw us Lady Sif, Unshakable, and a Angela. Uh, Lady Sif will play Unshakable, giving us Steady. Um, Angela, mm, we may actually hang on to Angela. Do we want to... Yeah, I think we do. So let's go ahead and use... We could draw a boot camp, which would be really nice. Um, let's go Angela to play Limitless Stamina to stand up. And then we're going to swing for four. Take him down to six. We're going to flip down to Odin's Son. We're going to Hall of Heroes to draw Hand Cannon, Hammer Throw, and Into the Fray. Uh, Power of Aggression will play a Hand Cannon. We got a into the fray and a hammer throw. I'm gonna hang on to both of these, I believe. Um, Nick will go ahead and thwart two here. Take that down to four. Sweet. Never frontline specialist. Concussive blast. When the hood gets pushed. We're going to choose, and then Foul Play just gets way worse because it's discard the top two and deal each card not belonging to the hood. But I think I push him here. Um, first things first. Let's go ahead and rifle for one, two, three, three damage. Down to three. 
Then X jet stored energy. Now let's go energy. Um, make the call to pull in X. We'll confuse the hood. X will thwart down unbridled ambition. Nick actually attacks for three. Yeah. Let's use a Malcolm to play Pixie. After Pixie enters play, we're going to go grab a Beak. Beak, Beak, Beak. Beak, nice. Okay, Pixie's there. Let's have Beast go ahead and punch the hood for two. He's going to come in with 36 health. Then we're going to choose a set aside. Reroll the six. Nope. One, two. We got Dark Riders coming in hot. So those get there. And then the foul play is horrendous. Pretty much. But we are, we're, I mean, like, we're looking to push here. That is the goal. So let's, uh, Stored energy and a command authority will play a concussive blast uh, to deal six damage here. Readying bishop. Pixie will thwart one here, down to three. Stored energy will overplay, over, overpay beak, overplay Pixie, remove three threat from here. We're gonna go to 12. He is confused. Odin's son is down. We do have the we're running the risk of drawing into like an advanced type thing, which is probably fine. We're just gonna go three. We're just gonna push the damage here. Um, take him down to 27. And stand up. I still have this rapid response. Oh, we're going to Rapid Response X back in to confuse the hood. That's what we're going to do. We got Into the Fray and a Hammer Throw. I'm actually going to toss Into the Fray. I'm going to keep Hammer Throw. Got six, four Asgard. Hammer Throw, Boot Camp, Relentless Assault, two, four, five, and another Relentless Assault. And Bishop has got a Concussive Blast. I do like seeing that damage. Or we could hit, we could rapid response beast in, so we could. I don't. I do not want to go. I think I'm going to rapid response Professor X in, uh, just so we don't scheme. We can't scheme. Yeah. Okay. So we got concussive blast or band together. Make the call. Energy conversion. One, two, three, four, five. Genius. I go five here, go up to 12. The hood is going to attack, no, is going to scheme. So we got confused there. We're going to block with Professor X on the attack of three. You are stunned and confused. Good. Good, good, good. I think Odin's son is half, half stunned because I took out uh, Sinyaka. Okay. Uh, Professor X, we will rapid response Professor X back in and confuse. 
Um, Frost Giant is going to attack us for three. We'll take it. Discard one, two, three. We got to band together. That's nice. Then we will heal Uniform for one, two, three. And we'll pass out encounter cards. Odin Sun, Amelia. We got Upper Hand, the Hood Schemes. Or the Hood attacks you. Resolve the foul play. No. No. Okay. Well, we'll have Professor X block this. It's going to be three plus three. There's a hit, Professor X. Good. Good block. Foul play. We got Delgado dealt to us. And then Metamask is not the Hood. Let's go. We got Hard Drive. After Hard Drive attacks, place one threat on each scheme. And then we've got Delgado. Who is going to activate and attack us for two? We have no guards. Nick is going to leave play. I'm going to pass over here to Bishop. Frontline specialist. Got my sword energy. Okay, um, clear the sun, I'm going to rifle, I'm, I'm going, I'm, I'm going for it here, we're going to go one, two, three, four damage here, take this down to 23, um, we're going to make the call. Uh, I'm trying to figure out if I want to make the call for Nick. If I make the call Nick, these guys die, but we can also, we're going to do it. We're going to play make the call, uh, stored energy and a genius to pull Nick Fury out. I'm going to draw stored energy, supercharged, nice, and a Malcolm. Drop his supercharge onto the table. Um, band together. We'll play a concussive blast for six damage here. So we're going to... Nope, that's not how that works. So we are at 23. Um, minus six is 17. And we get to ready bishop. Nick, Beast, Beak is five. Okay. X Jet, stored energy. No, X Jet. Uh, band together in energy conversion. We'll play Malcolm. Malcolm will attack for two. We're going to discard a sword energy to ready and attack for two more. Take him down to eight. Feeling pretty decent about this. Okay. Uh, Bishop will attack for two. Odin's son will draw. Three cards, limitless stamina, lightning strike, and a hammer throw. We got we got some damage, my friends. Um, okay, let's uh, let's flip up to Thor. Thor, why is Thor exhausted? Did we draw. A, I don't know. That's fine. Uh, God of Thunder, limitless stamina to ready Thor. Thor is gonna punch for four. Take him down to two. We'll draw into Thor's helmet using Combat Specialist. And a hammer throw. Mjolnir. Another hammer throw. So we can 
we'll go ahead and use the hand cannon. So that's going to knock him down to zero, winning us the game. Hammer throw is going to be eight damage to the hood. Uh, returning Mjolnir. God of Thunder will play Mjolnir again. Then we're going to play another hammer throw, dealing 16 excess damage. And this is this is kind of one of the things that I've been realizing, is that I think I can get to lethal way quicker than I thought. Like, I thought that was going to be tight. I was like, we may not get there. And, like, we blew it out of the water. So I think I have a fairly bad uh, understanding of how much damage I actually have. But there you go. There's whatever. I don't even remember what challenge number this was but this is the uh teamwork makes the dream work that was that got hairy there for a little for a little bit good stuff thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it see you next time peace